everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm gonna take you guys along and share with you our favorite chocolate chip cookie recipe. I'm gonna share the ingredients with you. I'm gonna share the steps so you can get these made up in your home. Um, these cookies have a slight crunchy outside and a super moist chewy inside. They're delicious. And I just wanna throw this in here before we begin. If you are at a higher altitude and you have had all the issues with baking cookies, spreading thin, flat, not working for you don't waste any more ingredients go ahead and give these a try and i promise you you will not be disappointed um just for an example we are at 7600 feet elevation and these work beautifully for us and i know people who have used this recipe at a slightly higher elevation around 8,000 feet and it's worked great so whatever elevation you are you do not have to tweak and change the recipe amounts down below um, actually down below. I'm going to throw in a recipe card in the video. But anyway, let's go ahead and get started and get these cookies made up. Okay, so for this cookie recipe, what I have here in this bowl, I sifted together three cups of all-purpose flour, one teaspoon of baking soda, and half a teaspoon of kosher salt. Over here in this bowl, I have three-quarter cup of packed light brown sugar and three-quarters cup of white sugar. I also have one and a half teaspoons of vanilla extract. I have one cup of chocolate chips, um, semi-sweet. I have two large eggs, and I also have one cup of unsalted butter at room temperature. Okay, so the first thing we are going to do is we are going to take our one cup of unsalted softened butter. We're going to put it in the bowl. Once we have our butter in the bowl, we are going to add our brown sugar and our white sugar. And you are going to mix it on medium speed for about two minutes or until it's light and fluffy. After your mixture is light and fluffy, you are then going to add your two eggs and get that mixed up for a couple seconds. And once your eggs are combined, you are then going to add in your vanilla extract and then mix it on low for a couple seconds. Once your eggs and vanilla are fully combined into the mix, you are going to add your sifted flour and baking soda and salt, and then you are going to slowly mix that into the wet ingredients until it's just combined. Once your mixture is combined, I just did that on a low speed for a couple of seconds, you are going to stir in your chocolate chips. And this just reminded me, my husband likes them without chocolate chips. <laughs> so, oops, good thing I caught that. Um, so I'm going to do a couple for him. And all you have to do, you can use a cookie scoop. I personally like to do mine about two tablespoons um, in size for my dough do a little bit more but uh yeah I should have done that should have done this first <laughs> so I'm gonna get a couple mix up for him now I'm going to continue to mix in the chocolate chips just on the stir setting I'm now going to finish scooping these up let me use my ice cream scoop and go ahead and get the rest of the cookies on here once again oven preheated to 350 degrees <laughs> preheated to 350 degrees these can go in your oven times vary with the type of oven you have for roughly 12 to 15 minutes I usually pull mine at about 13 minutes so I will see you back in 13 minutes okay these cookies just came out they smell so so good I'm gonna let them sit for about five minutes on the tray before I transfer them to a cooling rack all right, you guys, the cookies are done. Some of them, what I did is I sprinkled a little bit of sea salt on them because I personally like that sweet and salty taste. This one's still a little bit warm, but I'm just gonna show you it cooks beautifully. Like I said, a little bit crispy outside, nice, soft, and chewy on the inside. All right, you guys, I hope you give these cookies a try. And if you do, I really hope that you guys enjoy them. Like I said, this is one of our favorite recipes. I will see you guys 
on the next video. I hope you guys are enjoying some family time um, around this Christmas season. And I will see you guys on Christmas. So until then, take care and God bless.